So Disney owns Fox. That means they can cancel all of the movies people are scratching their head about, such as Gambit, right? Wrong. Of course they can't. They have to be committed to these because contracts were put in place prior to them purchasing them. So they have to at least see their way through the first one unless they can find some sort of legal way to go about not making this movie. I mean, it's not like the Gambit movie hasn't fallen through about three times previously. I mean, guys, remember, this movie was supposed to come out in October of 2015. So it's been quite a while, but here's the brand new news. The Gambit movie, which will star Gambit, presumably, I would assume, alone in this movie, unless um, something else happens, maybe he'll be joined by Rogue or someone, we don't really know, is going to cost $155 million of Disney's money. And the film is shooting in New Orleans this March. Now, if you guys don't know, New Orleans is a pretty cheap place to shoot, and a lot of people go down there to the south to actually shoot films there because of tax cuts. Now, let's kind of frame this in a way we can try to understand it. $155 million gives this movie a budget that is $100 million more than Deadpool. Now, to put this into an even bigger perspective, Ant-Man cost $130, Wonder Woman cost $149, Doctor Strange $165, and Spider-Man Homecoming $175. And to compare it to Fox movies, Logan cost $97 million. So this movie is going to be on par with the budget of Wonder Woman. Now, just so we're clear again, this is Gambit. He can light up cards and throw them. He lights up cards and throws them. So you could probably see how this could be a problem with Disney. It's a movie they're inheriting that they possibly have to produce unless something goes way wrong with it. They're already committed to a bunch of it and it's going to cost them a lot of money and the return in it might not be there. So this could be a bit problematic and could, you know, turn out to be first, I guess, Disney Fox hit that they really have no control over that's going into production right after they buy them and they just have to, I guess, pray for the best is really the best way to say it. It's going to be rather interesting to see how this plays out.